Hello everyone and welcome to Lawrence Plays, where we're playing Manhunt Checkpoint. And that means it's my, it's my, I'm driving around the uh, city trying to find some checkpoints and trying to grab them. And there are some hunters. I think we've got, yeah, we've got three of them today. Uh, we've got uh, Tristan in purple, we've got Max in pale blue, and we've got Mark in uh, lime green. And the three of them will be driving around the city looking for me, trying to find, trying to hunt me down, trying to shoot me dead. Um, and if they do, if they manage that, then they win the game. If, on the other hand, I manage to take all five checkpoints, then I win the game. And um, that's obviously so. That's going to be what I'm going to try and do. So at the moment, I've got my first checkpoint. I'm being told that's in Life Invader, um, which is quite a way away from, uh, across the city from here. So it's a bit of a drive to get there. Um, but I'm going to go off, take that one, try and take that one. If I take, if I do take it, if I take that, then I'll be given a second checkpoint. If I take that, I'll be given a third, and so on until I've got all until I've got all hat. Managed to pick up all five of them. There's one of the hunters in purple. So the hunters are all driving garishly coloured cars to make them stick out a bit. I can't see him. He's that way now. Uh, too busy waving. If I wave my camera around too much, I won't be able to drive in a straight line properly. So, so the hunters are going to be driving around the city looking for me. Um, and, and to help them find me, there is a circle on their map. <clears throat> and that grows and shrinks based on what speed I'm doing and moves around based on where I am. So if I touch the edge of it, it will jump and it will put me in to make sure that I'm always somewhere inside the circle. I'm pretty sure that fire engine that went past has Max in it. Because that green car there is Mark. <clears throat> and the purple one we saw earlier was Tristan. So, you know, by process of elimination, <laughs> it didn't seem to be driving in a particularly AI-like fashion. So, I'm going to try and drive around the city. I'm going to try and I'm going to try and sneak around a bit. There's rather a lot of cars parked here, though. And unfortunately, if cars start to build up in large quantities, that's a bit of a sign to the hunters that there's a player in the area. So, yeah, I don't really want to be caught in traffic like this, and not for the usual reasons that I don't want to be caught in traffic in real life. Although to be honest there's some overlap there it's it's still annoying and slows me down and what these traffic lights only letting one vehicle through each time they change that's um, gonna make life a bit tri tricky as well I think I'm just gonna follow this car in front of me when the lights go green again whether there's uh, whether whether it stays green or not but yeah as, as you can see because I'm sat here stationary the cars are building up around me to a rather excessive extent so if a hunter comes along here and sees the this this mess they're gonna get very very suspicious so I don't really want to be sat in the middle of this and here comes a fire engine just attacking everything I'm gonna try and panic like an AI would um, AI's panic when unexpected things like fire engines ramming into them happen so I'm gonna run around here and then off this way and I want to Oh, no, I'm being chased. Okay. I was hoping to be able to use the uh, distraction from the... Uh, well, I was hoping that, that that I'd be able to run away in such a way that it... Yeah, it made it... Um, that they didn't suspect me. But However, Tristan is now following me, so that's a problem. He's in what looks like some sort of... It looks a bit like a Toyota Land Cruiser or something like that. I'm not quite sure what it is. I'm not very good at uh, SUVs because I'm not that interested in them. Um, but yes, he's chasing me. I can hear Max somewhere. Oh no, this is a dead end. Oh no, this is a problem. Uh, reverse? Forwards, 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 but my, so I just need to try and flee from him at this point. Um, now I do seem to have a little bit more acceleration than he does. Uh, I don't know whether I'm going to be able to use that. I should hopefully have a little bit more, slightly better handling because he's in a massive heavy SUV. I'm in a very compact sedan. Is it a compact or a sedan? It's a sedan, but it's slightly more compact than it was when I when I first got it because it's been bashed around a bit. Um, so I'm going to run up this way. He's probably still fairly close behind me and still following me because I haven't done anything to lose him yet. But there is the checkpoint that I'm aiming for. Woo, slide. I'm going to head away from it though and just carry on up this way. No, he's still right there. Um, I should probably... Uh, I could turn the circle off, uh, which makes it slightly harder for them to track me. But when they're right behind me, like Tristan is at the moment, they don't need much help tracking me. Or they don't need the circle to help them track me. Where's he gone? Oh! He was blooming my... Oh, if I'd realised he'd had that much of an issue, I'd have done something different and just got out of there. Ah, oh, that's really frustrating. What if I go up here? Is that possible? Is that a thing I can do? Not really. 
Is that a thing I can try slightly harder to do? Yes. Did that get me away? If it did, I'm going in here. Well, I'm going in here whether it did or not, actually, it turns out. But I can now park my uh, car around here. And I can change into... I'm going to end up with a smashed window if I take this, aren't I? Yes. But at least it's a different vehicle. I don't know if I want this. Oh, I don't know. This, is, this feels like a fairly poor choice of car. However, it's a different car. And that's pretty good at this point. And it's got me back out on the... Oh, no, it's a dead end. Let's not go that way. It's got me back out into the game and in a vehicle they haven't seen yet and therefore hopefully will not be suspicious of if they see it. Now, I've done some incredibly dodgy driving coming out of there, but never mind. So let's pull up at this red light here. Have a look around. Things seem to be fairly safe now, so it looks like I've actually got away with that. That bailing up, up that little pedestrian area and then into that driveway seems to have got me away. And conveniently, there was a car to borrow in just the right place. Yeah, that's fire engine again. Which way is it? I think it's behind me. I'm gonna go. I'm going to go, even though it's a red light, because I don't want to hang around if I can avoid it. Here comes Tristan up the wrong side of the road, doing an investigate. He stopped and turned round. I have a bad feeling about this. I'm going to stop at this red light anyway and see what happens. I think he's identified me and is now lurking in the area until a um, until another hunter turns up and they can tag team me. So that means it's, it's time for me to get out of here again. I think. No, he's not followed me. What? Either somebody, either he's being very very sneaky, or he didn't twig that that was me. Either way, I'm going to go around here and I'm going to take this checkpoint. So I have to stop. Then I can take the checkpoint, then I can go. Okay, I've been given a two-star wanted level. That is unhelpful. Um, <laughs> so we have we have checkpoint effects, which are a random thing happening when a checkpoint is taken. This, so this this time, the, the effect is that everybody's been given a two-star wanted level, which is kind of bad for me, because if I drive... In order to evade the police, you need to go quickly, essentially. But in order to not look suspicious to the hunters, I need to go slowly. So I'm going to try and just get away from the area where I was in. And, um, oh, I've got to go miles to the oil fields. Okay, All right. Highway run time then, I think. Which is also going to take me away from the cops, so that's good. If I, get onto the hi if I get onto the highway here, then I can bimble across the city. It's a bit more than a bimble, to be honest. It's going to be a high-speed cruise across the city. I can't believe I got away with that when Tristan was parked right next to me and I thought... No way am I way hanging around here and ran the red light. Somehow he didn't notice me, I think. Because he didn't chase me. Or if he did, he got snarled up on something else. So I have no idea what happened there. That's very weird. Okay, there's a cop ahead of me. I need to slow down a bit and not catch up with him. Okay, he's gone. Right, good. Now I'm safe to just carry on cruising. So I'm just going to follow this highway. I'm going to stick with the highway. I've got a, a mediocre vehicle, um, which is sort of a good thing. So, we have a rule in this game where the hunters aren't allowed to use a class of vehicle until they've seen the prey using it. Um, now, they get a few for free. They get coupes. No, they don't. <laughs> I keep saying that. They get compacts, they get sedans, and they get SUVs for free. Which is why the hunters tend to be driving SUVs, because they are usually the least bad, or at least the best at intercepting um, of, the, of the classes they're allowed to use. Now, um, if, they, if they, they can risk it if they want, and they can use a better car than they are actually allowed to use but if i if i see that if i see them doing that then i can decide i want to blow them up and there's, there's an option in my menu system where i can i can blow up any hunter who's using a vehicle then that, that hasn't been unlocked so it's sort of a risk reward thing for them if they think that maybe i've you well i'm going the wrong way um if they think that maybe i've used a um a, a sports car for example they could decide that they want to use a sports car and they're going to risk it um but they're risking getting blown up if i haven't if they decide they want to, uh, or um, yes, so so basically they're they're allowed to risk it if they want, but I can. But if I then get into a chase with them, I can use it quite tactically to blow them up and just get get them off my tail for good, which is quite satisfying on on the occasions when I get to do it. <laughs> uh, right. I'm not going to slow down very much here, even though there's a red light there, because 
I think my best advantage at this point. I this this the, this checkpoint is way off on the edge of town, so it's a difficult one for me to take and sneak away from. So I'm just going to take it quickly, and then keep moving. I'll just get out of here. I've got the police effect again. Oh goodness sake! Right, let's. Oh, there's Mark attacking me as usual. What's he driving? That looks like. Is that a compact? No, I think that might be. A, I think that might be an illegal car. So let's try and um, let's try and blow him up. So in abilities, I have detonate illegal hunters. Apparently, oh, that did not have the effect I expected. I thought Mark was driving an illegal car. That must be a, that must be a sedan. Um, but apparently, a fire engine is not um, is not allowed at this point. Uh, <laughs> woo! I couldn't remember what the rules for emergency vehicles were. I knew that police cars count as sports cars, but a, oh, Tristan's upside down. That's Good. I have no acceleration. That's bad. Tristan has ploughed Mark into the into the wall. That's good. Um, let's go up this hill, like that. I've still got the cops, which is frustrating because they will start probably start shooting at me. If I get killed by the cops, I will not be happy. Also, the cops are going to be chasing me, which tells the hunt gives the hunters a bit of a clue as to where I am. But I seem to have lost the hunters. Oh, cop! Get off. Okay, so reckless drivers is the radio. Yeah, all right. There's quite a lot of cops in this area because there's actually a police station there. So I think I don't want to be, I don't want to be around here. I'm just going to keep moving, especially as the next checkpoint, pier entrance, is in this direction. So I'm just going to keep going. Um, I'm going to turn here because there's a cop straight ahead. So I don't want to run into that cop. I do want to get way down here. I'm, I'm not going to do anything else funny. No, no more funny business until I've lost my wanted level. Uh, let's head down into the. Um, into the ghetto, though, actually. Let's see what that cop's doing ahead of me. Come on, lose the wanted level. I said lose the wanted level. Not not gain a hunter. Jeez. Okay, nope, I've regained the wanted level, and I hadn't... Turns out I hadn't lost the hunter. I thought I had. Turns out, no. Um, they were still with me. I mean, to be fair, I hadn't done anything particularly clever or evasive. I was more thinking about losing the cops than I was about the hunters, which is not the right way to play this game because the hunters are quite a lot more dangerous and tenacious than the cops. The cops will eventually get bored um, and just leave me alone. The hunters will not and the, hun the hunters don't have quite as many clues and they don't automatically recognise me on sight like the cops do. But yeah, they're a bit more uh, a bit more tenacious and a bit more dangerous and you see they're still, still right there. So, I'm going to have to get out of here. I still, I'm still trying to do do both, both the losing the cops and losing the hunters at the same time, which is not good. Let's 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 end or breaking maneuver on Tristan there. Um, I mean that had works to an extent, but because there's two of them chasing me, it's not the most it's not the most sensible thing to do. It's just when he pulls up alongside me, it's too tempting not to. So <laughs> let's go through here, sideways, upside down, every way up. I don't know. Ooh, this isn't a way through. Maybe it is. Maybe it's a way through. I'm not sure. <laughs> this is not going so well. Let's send the car back up again. A bit of reversing. There we go. Let's duck in case Tristan's got out and starts. No, but he's right there. Uh... <laughs> okay, so the hunters have been communicating, which is very rude of them. <laughs> which is how um, Mark managed to turn up there and just be ready and more or less ready and waiting when I when I came out of the year. Uh... Oh! Conch. Thank you. That'll turn me around again, I suppose. Right, I'm going off the edge of here because you can't stop me. Because it's basically because it's a way, and that's my best bet at this point, I think. Um, although I can then, go, if I then go back up here, where's Tristan? It's not there. Let's come off here then. Take this jump. Oh no! I'm going to hedge it. I've hedged it. <laughs> I did not want to hedge my bets. So, right, um, this way maybe? Um, I think I'm going to turn off the circle. Like that. They're not behind me at the moment, which is nice. Not behind me is where I like the hunters to be. Oh, I couldn't say. <laughs> Let's just abandon the car. And try... Not climb on random nonsense. Could cross the road. I need a new car. 
this one will do. Oh, no, it won't because it didn't stop. Damn it. I should have learnt by now, because I've done this wrong many, many times in the past. I should have learnt not to try and change cars on a busy road. It never goes well. There's purple lights ahead of me. I'm going up here. Hide. Question is, will he see my abandoned car? And if so, what will he do about it? Is this is this a useful place to go? I'm going to say probably not. Oh, does this guy take me up onto higher? No, it just takes me up onto the top of a building. This is not helpful. I should probably turn the circle back on. Just like that. Um, <laughs> just because leaving it off for excessive amounts of time is a bit rude. Um, and this is me being... This is me being stupid time rather than me just doing a quick car change time. So, um, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty safe because I'm up here. And there's no way they'll find me up here. But on the other hand, there's no way I'll ever get any checkpoints up here. So the game's just never going to end. Um, I was hoping that these stairs would go somewhere useful, but nope. None of that. Let's come back down here. Let's see if I can get somewhere. Maybe drop down onto the highway. That could be potentially useful. Can I do that without dying? Probably not. Worth try that. Let's let's try it. No, that's that's far too far to drop. I'm not doing that. There's Max. Don't want to be anywhere near him. Because another because he's another hunter. So yeah, I f was hoping that from here I'd be able been, would have been able to get over onto that um, onto onto the upper level of the of higher lower over there. Seems that's not to be though. That is not a th apparently not a thing. Um, I think I need to just steal a car at this junction here and and accept that I can't be very incognito doing so. Oh, walking is so slow, but running is so obvious. Um, so that's a muscle car. It's just going round there because it's doing the right turn on red. Let's take that. Is that a jackal? Ooh, what's that? All right, let's take the sports car. So this will unlock sports cars for the hunters, which is a shame, but it's a shame I'll put up with. I think Mark might have just seen me steal this car. Um, just in case he didn't see me steal the car, I'm going to pull a quick turn round here. And go this way. Which is the direction I want to go. Um, yeah, so hopefully that's been enough to throw him off. If he did see me do that. Of course the circle is going to move in this direction. So the hunters will be coming this way as well. But my hope is that that dive across the, across the um, highway there. And off in a different direction. Is going to be enough to throw him off. So around here. There's an ambulance there. I. It's driving kind of suspiciously. I don't know. I'm not sure whether that's a hunter or not. It's a little bit suspicious, but also it's. I don't know. The AI can be a bit weird sometimes as well. Ooh, green light. Let's go. Okay, so we are no now no longer in a chase. Um, I'm not sure whether whether I can when it counted as being. An, chase and when it didn't. Thank you. Thank you for indicating way after you started moving. There's Mark with the green headlights and the green car and the green everything. Uh, what's he doing? Put that car on. Oh no. I'm pulling up to five ways. Five ways is frustrating because it takes forever for the lights to change. There's Max. What's he doing? We're all panicking. All the cars are panicking because somebody produced a shotgun. So, I don't know. Yeah, so I'm, um, I'm, I'm I'm joining in with them all. So, I was a bit afraid there that we're going to have the... Um, the prop He's going to get out and point it in and just immediately shoot me. And if he'd done that, then I'd have been in a lot of trouble. There's, there's Tristan. I think there's been reports of a blue sports car. So, I'm um, not hanging around. <laughs> um... Yeah, I think they, they probably, the other hunters will have said there's a blue sports car acting suspicious if anyone sees it. And then I happen to run more or less into Tristan, so. So, yeah, he's um, now going to be 
in in hot pursuit, should we say, or at least lukewarm pursuit, because I mean he's in a jeep, so <laughs> he's not that hot. Oh, corner! There we go, and down, and another corner, and oh, and a lot of slide, and let's go back up here again. That's a lot of slide. This is not my favourite sports car. My favourite sports car is the Jester, or possibly the um, the Schwartz. So they're both, yeah, they're both great. But this one will do. I mean, it's, it's not bad. Whoop. And here's the checkpoint. I see no hunters. I see no hunters. Right, okay. Checkpoint approach. Here we go. And pull up. Stop in the checkpoint. Take the checkpoint. Go. And all the cars have turned blue. So that's, again, another checkpoint effect, as you probably guessed. So the point of this is sort of that, well, now all the cars are blue. Every spawned-in car is turned to blue. So I kind of need to get away from the area where, that, where I uh, took the checkpoint and then try and find a car to change into that isn't blue because any blue cars moving around will be look very, very suspicious because it's really, really obnoxious garish colour. But I also kind of need to change into another sports car because all the hunters will now be using sports cars because they are allowed to. Um, I've escalated the game quite significantly by switching into this, um, and they're probably all aware that this, that's what this is. Oh, no, I'm also heading away from the next checkpoint, which is foolish, but mm, not too much of a problem. Maybe I'll just stick with the blue car until I find something as good. So I don't really. There's not going to be any good cars over here in the ghetto. There, you, you don't get sports cars spawning down here generally. So what, what's that? Oh, so that's a coupe. Oh no, that's a. Uh, I'm not sure which one that is. That's the one that's probably a sedan. All right, we'll take a coupe. It's not quite as good as the. It's not as good as a sports car, for sure. So when we, when when I next get into a chase, which is fairly inevitable, it won't be brilliant for trying to keep away, stay away from them. Here comes two two of the hunters. So one of them is still in his previous car because it was blue, and the other one has changed. So that's that's fine. That that's um. They're allowed to do that. That's that's not a problem. Uh, makes identifying them a little bit harder. Although I'm pretty sure that was um, Max. Tristan is also still in his jeep. He's chasing that car. Okay. There's two hunters behind me, and I'm badly parked. Very. Oh no, that's not my light. That's not my green light. I nearly went. Okay, so the hunters are all over the place at the moment. In fact, Mark is still there. Can I have a green light, please? I really, really need a green light because I don't want to be here. There we go, it's a green light. So the hunters are currently all over... Well, they're all over this area. They don't seem to actually be all over me, which is nice. Um, but they're very much in this area. So I'll switch over to this lane so I can now, I can now turn right at the end of here without having to stop, because, or at least without having to wait. I'm going to do it without stopping. I'm just going to go around here. Because I'm quite close to Square of Squares now. It shouldn't be too hard to get that checkpoint. I just need to get there without drawing too much attention, and so I just want to keep moving. Now my my hope there was that there were, I knew there weren't any hunters behind me because I just looked. So it's a two-part hope actually. One part was that I hope there weren't any there weren't any hunters uh, coming out who'd, who'd appeared just behind behind me just after I started moving because that does happen sometimes and it's quite frustrating. <laughs> um, and the other part is I hope that they're um, they wouldn't approach from the as cross traffic and and and, tweet and spot me that way. Those are both things that can happen, can and do happen. Right, so the, the next checkpoint is just over there. I'm really close to it. Things are going quite well. I have unfortunately unlocked sports cars for the um, for the hunters, which is bad. Uh, and one of them has taken advantage of that. I have technically unlocked coupes, but they haven't spotted me in a coupe yet, so they don't know that. Um, I'm going. I'm not waiting for this. There we go. Um, yeah, so that's not great. Okay, so uh, Max is using what uh, Mike refers to as the discount banshee. Uh, it's a punto. It's it, it's a smart car. Uh, it, it it's fairly terrible, but Max is quite it, Max tends to be quite a good driver, so it's sort of it's nice when he uses slightly less good cars because it gives me a chance. <laughs> um, I would like to still like to get that square squares checkpoint, and we've changed the rules recently to say that I don't have to be out of a chase in order to take a checkpoint. I just have to stop in the checkpoint, and that's supposed to mean if I am in a chase, it's incredibly dangerous to take a checkpoint. And I generally won't if I'm actually aware that I'm in a full-on chase. But if I'm not aware of it, and I don't, I'm not currently aware of being in a chase, uh, but I haven't sort of escaped quite as thoroughly as I usually like to. Blue, blue cars again, eh? All right. Um, 
Is Tristan chasing me? I saw him coming approaching for over there, but he doesn't seem to be following me. Right, okay, let's carry on this way and get out of here. So what I want to do now is get over into North Vinewood and find a sports car up there. Because this this is a Zion. Zion? Zion. Um, is It's not bad. It's a coupe. It's one of the better coupes. I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. But I am also aware that the hunters are driving, uh, mostly dri or potentially going to be driving um, sports cars. And so that's a little bit terrifying. Um, because they're better. They're, their cars are better than mine. That ma makes it that bit harder for me to escape from them. It doesn't make it impossible. As we've dem I've demonstrated a couple of times now, I've, I've, I've managed to escape. But it's a lot harder. We could take a sports classic. That's another class that I haven't used yet. But no, I don't... I, I should... I need to learn not to change cars on busy road, and this is a busy road. This is the main boulevard across through North Vinewood. So let's get off this road and head out over this way. There's another, there's another uh, coupe. I'm in a blue car though. I, I just, I, I shouldn't be faffing around going, um, not that one, not that one, not that one. I should just take something, anything like that. Uh, not maybe. Oh, I don't know. We'll oh God, no. That's a, uh, was that? ah! it's a fugitive. That's not a good car. That's a sedan. Um, oh, that's what um, Mark was driving earlier when I tried to blow him up, and it turned out it wasn't a, it wasn't a sports car he was in. Okay, the fugitive is not a sports car, not by a long way. It makes a nice noise. It's probably a big V6 or something like that, but it doesn't have an enormous turn of speed. Right, so I need to get over to the golf course. Um, I mean, that's not a difficult drive. It's just sort of a that way. Just follow the main. The main road from the top here. I don't want to sit here waiting though. Um, it's just, yeah, follow this, basically follow this road and it'll more or less take me to the, I think it takes me to the top of the golf course, whereas the checkpoint is at the bottom of golf course. But basically, it's just a straight, a dead, this road will take me to where I need to go. But I don't really want to be doing it in a fugitive. Alright, let's get, let's take that Citroen. I can't remember what they're called, a Picali? Something like that? No, not the bus. That one. It's a sports classic. Um, yeah, Pigali. It's a sports classic, which is... It's okay. It's um, it's better than... Well, it's probably similar similar to the coupe I had earlier, actually. So it's not going to be as good as the, as the proper modern sports cars that the others might potentially be driving if they want. Um, but it's also a little bit... I'd like to say it's a little bit more um, innocuous, a little bit hard, less less likely to be seen and be suspicious, and, and for them to be suspicious of, because it's just it's a slightly weird choice. I don't know. I'm going to give it a go. See how things see, see how things last. Now with the um, with the with the genre clone uh, mode we used to have, where um, the hunters would be put in um, another car of the same class that I was driving. This is a fantastic choice because um, the the sports classic contains all kinds of well terrible and um, they're terrible because they're old-fashioned and they're just not they're not modern vehicles but lots and lots of terrible terrible cars Oop, there you go oh uh, max is in a banshee in a real banshee this time not a discount banshee that's gonna be dangerous if he spots me <clears throat> banshees are pretty good um yeah so they, 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 they can then get put in all kinds of weird ridiculous ancient things and it's quite funny and tactical and no dear Tristan's investigating cars here because there's too many cars in a queue as I, was, as I think I was talking about earlier um, if you have lots and lots of cars bunched up together it's a good this it, it makes it seem it's very likely that there's a player in the area and so because the hunters flit around at the speeds they do they're going to guess that the player in the area is probably me but I'm getting some green lights now this is this is good getting lots of green lights in a row maybe I'll just make some good progress along here um, I'm on a reason. I was going to say I'm on a reasonably small road. That's not particularly true. Let's turn left here because the lights say I can. And this is taking me down, yeah, round the edge of the golf course. This is this is the long way round, but it's taking me in basically the right direction. I'm, I'm got a good roll on. I'm just going to skip that, uh, skip that red light, run that red light, come down here, get a right turn at the bottom here, and then another right turn. Nothing behind me. I'm going to squeeze through the gap here. Take the, take the corner. I seem to, things seem to be going very very well at the moment. So that's round here. So it's another red light, but it's a right turn. So I think that's I don't know that that particular junction. I'm not convinced that it was okay to turn right there, but um, I'm, I'm, I, I don't care because there is the final checkpoint. So pull up in the checkpoint. 
boot button. Today's effect is everybody gets out of their vehicle, including um, including AIs apparently, which is nice. Um, and then I'm going to disappear down this alleyway. Now the fine, we are now in what's called the final hunt, and this means that the uh, the the hunters now have about 30 seconds to, to before they explode. They, I have my objective is to get more than a certain distance, which is a few hundred meters, I think, away from the hunters for about 30 seconds. If I can do that, they all explode and I win the game. And that's that's the sort of the, the fine finale, to, basically to prove that we I haven't that uh, that we're not in a that there isn't a chase active at the moment. I'm. I don't know. I'm on top of this parking garage because I came in here looking for sports cars. There don't seem to have been any, which is a bit of a shame. There were some coupes further down. But my kind of hope is that the hunters will end up just driving away from here looking for me. Um, and therefore they'll explode. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. But let's come down off the top of here, actually. Don't go in the tennis courts. Good enough. They haven't just exploded. I'm going to drive away from here some level of speed. That might be Tristan in the blue. No, maybe not. That probably was Tristan's old, um, whatever that is, Jeep thing. But I don't think he's using it. So, I'm going to do the head out of town strategy from here. Because, as I say, I just need to get a distance away from them. And the easiest way to do that is to hoon away up a major road like this that just disappears off into the countryside. There probably aren't any hunters up here. You never know, but there probably aren't. Maybe I should have taken that in furnace. So I'm just going to, yeah, put my foot down. There we go. Now they're all exploding. Right. So I have now won the game. So thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I hope you've enjoyed that. And we'll, uh, we'll be back at some point in the future when I've had time to make another video. So I shall see you then. Bye-bye. A lot of traffic at Mega Mall. This must, he must be in a line. Uh, he isn't spawning uh, much traffic anymore. He will still gradually spawn traffic, but it's traffic is more likely to be generated by us. Careful, uh, there's a black car here. I think I found him. Towards Benny's. Tram tracks follow? Uh, no, maybe not. He actually is following NPC lines. There's one driving quickly here, but it was driving away from Max, so it may have a good reason. We'll see if the circle moves in a minute. This feels like a player, south side of Square of Squares, heading west. I'll update you if the circle moves. He swerved over to the wrong side of the road, so yeah, I think this is him. The circle should move in. No, he's sticking inside the circle, heading south. <laughs> uh, turned right into the dead end. Uh, 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 no. Female character model, uh, shortish, sort of not quite shoulder length, reddish hair, uh, west towards red car park, south side. Passing red car park now. Uh, what car? Uh, black sedan. Turn north a couple of roads after, towards five ways. West side of Art Gallery, crossing the bridge. Uh, straight through northwest. Past the horse, turn left at low car parks. Went through over to the other side. So slight left, but otherwise straight on. Ah, uh, that's another 4x4. Four four. Uh, anti clockwise round golf course, but I've lost sight of him. I think he carried on, turned left at the north end, but way out of sight. Nope, turn back. Uh, Clockwise round golf course, heading to the southeast corner. I think he turned east there actually. No, that wasn't maybe that wasn't him. Black sedan. Yeah. Go 
of course would be in range or he's on his way up the hills maybe. And north side of golf course is not traffic? I think it was oil fields. Yeah, oil fields. Not even in the circle. Me neither. I think I have them heading uh, north. Um, on the most eastern road. Why did that blow up? Did he blow me up? Yeah. Uh, so, black jeep. Um, not allowed. No, service cars. I copied you. <laughs> you said fire truck, right? What? Well, sorry. He went, he came off, and onto the bridge, heading west. Okay. What the bridge? The National Bridge? Uh, down. Uh, not towards Square Square. Industrial. Heading towards Square Square. Well, yeah. All right. Police nearly intercepted him. I mean, that's oh, a yeah. job. Good thing about being blown up. I don't know. Uh, west past Square Square, south side. South one before red car park. I'm following in the chase. Uh, if you get blown up, you're supposed to wait uh, 30 seconds before joining back in. I had to drive back from Mount Zoom. You're supposed to stop and not do anything for 30 seconds because you were caught driving oh, an illegal vehicle. But yeah, I mean, being ripped out of the chase is kind of. No, the point is, it's more than that. That's the point. Okay. Uh, Ring of Fire. Uh, west of that. Uh, heading round uh, some loop in Ghetto. Back onto tram lines. Uh, crossing over tram lines. I think this is Franklin's house. No, I don't think it is, actually. The last one was. Quite possibly. Uh, Mega Mall. Mega Mall. Crossing tram lines, heading east, northeast. One car is broken. Uh, left, round the hospital. I try to intercept. Last petrol station. Uh, turn right there. Uh, going off road. Off, basically opposite the petrol station. Boom. He's struggling to get through here, but so am I. Uh, we're under the highway some somewhere. Uh, highway junction. Going onto the highway. Is that a legal car, Mark? Uh, yes. If it's illegal, I don't want to be too close to you. <laughs> Going? Uh, right. North. Nope. Uh, coming off the highway. Down to the low way, I think. Yep, north on the low way. Should have just not bothered coming off. And going off oh, no. the uh, jump? Yeah, jump towards red car. Red car park jump. Nah. Right. After the heading east? Uh, yes, heading east from there. Lost eyes. Is it all the same, of course?
Don't think so, but... I didn't hear any sounds of contact, you just spun, which was especially weird. <laughs> Normally there's at least an exchange of paint, but... Uh, I'm pretty lucky, I've seen a lot of cars like quite a bit. Found him, uh, Life Invader. He's in a sports car, not sports, I think that's a sports car. Uh, it's a soft top. Um, round golf course clockwise, I have no chance okay. of keeping up. I've lost sight of him. I think I found him in a good pit. Yeah. Oh no, I crashed. Um, under the overpass now from Square Squares westbound. The north side of Square Squares is going underneath. Hmm. I think he went in the tunnel back towards Square Squares. I'm not sure at all. Uh, a black uh, coupe. Okay.